Well, good evening, and welcome to this Lenten meditation. We begin tonight with music, music that can help us still our minds and center our souls into the sacred. Let us now listen to this music from Herod. Let us now pray. God of all our days and nights, be with us in this place. Let your spirit wash over us, bringing peace to our hearts and to our minds, guiding our thoughts and helping us to hear you, O oh God, to feel you, to know you. As we begin to discover our purpose, how to love our neighbor, as well as ourselves, as we begin to reflect that love through word and deed. Help us this day to find that quiet center in this and all else we pray. Amen. Well, these are indeed difficult times, times in which it is hard to find that quiet, sacred center. Hard because our minds, they race with worry. They look back to what was, or they project into the future and in it all. We are anxious. The news seems to hound us, raising our blood pressure, our level of concern. Jesus, of course, lived also in difficult times. The crowds, they pressed in on him. The need of the people, it was so great that it and they seemed to follow Jesus like a rushing current wherever he went. Even for Jesus, it was too much. 
he needed to find a quiet place to pray, to clear his head so that he could remember his heart, so that he could heal, and in being healed, help bring healing to others. And so that is what we are here to try to do tonight. If you have not yet, Dim the lights in the room where you are, if you can. Light a candle or two, if you can. Shut the door to all that presses in on you, that you may have, in this moment at least, a quiet sanctuary. We give thanks tonight that Giramina Saltarain will lead us in a meditation and then in the Tibetan bowls. And so now I introduce Gisha. Hello everyone. This is Gisha Amina. I'm going to be playing the bowls for you tonight. This time from my house. And um, I wanted to tell you that I feel we're in all of this together because this is happening to all of us. So I believe it's good to take a break. Take a break from being in the mind a lot trying to understand, thinking about the future, thinking about the past. And I invite you to come back to the now, to being here, present, to feel your aliveness. You feel your body. How are you holding your body? Is there a resistance? Are you comfortable? Pay attention how, how you're sitting down. How's your spine? Is it great? It's important for the body to be straight so that the spine connects well with the rest of the body. It's good to take a few deep breaths. When you exhale, you let go of every tension, of any resistance that is holding you back. Try to use this moment to take a break from everything. Take a break from thinking. Just feel. Feel your body. Be comfortable. Feel your breathing. Make it slow. Open your chest. We tend to bend when you we're afraid, when we're when we're preoccupied, we tend to bend forward, so be straight, open your shoulders, open your chest, relax. Direct your attention to this present moment.
Every time a thought appears, be aware of the thought, but let it pass like a train. Direct your attention back to yourself, to your breathing. It's important to pay attention to the music and try to understand it, to feel it, as if you were a child listening for the first time. Be interested in the sound, the interest in the vibration, decide where you put your attention, if the mind starts talking, just look at it and let it pass like a train. Try to take a few deep breaths and every time you exhale, just let go. As if you're taking all the air out, let go. Try to come back to the present moment. It's a present moment that you can touch. You can smell it. You can listen to the music, listen to the vibration. It's good to come back to the senses. Sensing, feeling the music, connecting with the moment being alive, being alive like a child. Being interested in you, in your body, in your senses, in your breathing. It's important to have the intention to direct your attention to the present moment. Remind yourself that you're alive now. Thoughts talk about the future. We don't know how it's gonna be. We don't, we don't know what solutions are going to appear what helping hand, what idea, what, what is gonna happen, we don't know. But we can be grateful now to have the opportunity to be breathing, to have the opportunity to be alive, to have a house, to have a community. My invitation is to come back to feeling, to sensing. And just train your mind to be calm, because you're not going to pay attention to all the thoughts that the mind sent. The mind sends thoughts and you can choose not to get on that train. You're the station, stay there, be present. Let the train of thoughts pass and come back to the now. I hope you enjoy it, I hope it helps you. I hope you, you are fine and um, I know I'm going to see you soon. I 
hope you enjoy it. Thank you.
Well, I hope you have found some peace, a little bit of that quiet center for yourself this evening through words, meditation, the bowls, and the beautiful music. If you have a candle, if it is not lit, you can light it now. And let us say, if you have it, together, this is the closing prayer, it is the night prayer. Lord, it is night. The night is for stillness. Let us be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done, and what has not been done has not been done. Let it be. The night is dark. Let our fears of the darkness of the world and of our own lives rest in you. The night is quiet. Let the quietness of your peace enfold us, all dear to us and all who have no peace. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, to new joys, new possibilities. All of this in your name we pray. Amen. Go in peace.